Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is an ocean geo shaker which I have created a few days before and posted the photos on my Instagram and Facebook. With huge demand, I'm posting the process a video of this piece. So this, as this was an experiment, uh, you will see different steps, um, which were no longer in the final piece. As you can see, I'm working on a wooden substrate, and you can see the textured edges, which I spray painted gold. But later, I do not like it, like it, and had to remove it. I'm pouring the ocean colors and making the waves with a white oil paint, which I usually use. Now you can see that I have removed the textured um, edges, um, the gold ones and uh, again giving the ocean colors layers. This time I thought why not to use just the blue colors and remove the teal shade but then I thought it's something not of my style. I usually use teal color which I really like. So I had to remove this layer also because I do not like it at the later later stage. This is the actual piece which I created and you can see the colors are different now. I gave the layer. I did not shoot the video because I thought I won't be posting the video and uh, some steps might be missing but it will give you an idea of how did I create this piece. As you can see I have uh, pasted the plastic sheet at the bottom of the pocket and then gave the transparent resin layer so that it gets sticks to the surface and there shouldn't be any leak or um, any air to that because I, previously I thought I might put oil or water to move these small pieces like shells and pearls but then I thought the sound would um, which it will create would be nice and now I'm covering it with a plastic sheet you can use acrylic also and now I'm just testing that whether the small pieces will move or not and they are moving really well these are small shells and uh, pearls and uh, many more things which represent beach and you will find on the beach if you will go there and now I'm using some polish, oil free polish to stick the plastic sheet. Once it is sticked, I'm giving the transparent resin layer, the top coat on the piece. I actually got the idea of making this sort of piece by um, from sorry uh, from the shaker because I get inspired when I see a shaker small ones. So I thought why not, why not to make a bigger piece like this and I succeeded thankfully. It was my first attempt and uh, I am very happy with this. Thank you for liking my video and uh, my experiment. Keep watching my videos and uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet done it. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.